Hello, welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we'll show you how the cast of 1975 The Jefferson has changed. I show you what they looked like back then in 1975 and now in 2022, how they have changed compared to when they were on this sitcom. Alright, let's go. Sherman Hemsley in the sitcom play George Jefferson. He was 37 years old in 1975 and he was with Red Sinus that on July 24, 2012, Hemsley died at his home in El Paso, Texas at the age of 74 of superior vena cava syndrome. You wouldn't be a lawyer, would you? No, but I work in a lawyer's office. That's it! Wheezy, we're in luck! Maybe one of your relatives died and left us some dough. <laughs> <laughs> Before it was like this polite, my brother, da -da -da -ding -da -ding. so I didn't have really, I had just, just the words helped a lot. You know, what I'm saying helped a lot. And then, Isabel Sanford in a sitcom play, Louis Jefferson. She was 58 years old in 1975, and it was with great sadness that Sanford passed away of unspecified natural causes on July 9, 2004, at the age of 86. Oh yes, Mr. Bentley told us about you. Won't you come in, Miss Bryant? Mrs. I'm sorry. Uh, this is my husband, George. This is Mrs. Bryant. Not work under these conditions. I mean, he was always saying that. You see, he and uh, uh, Roxy knew each other in New York. Damon Evans in a sitcom play Leonel Jefferson season 2 to 4. In 1975, he was 26 years old and now he is 72 years old. I got a great deal. Normally it would cost us $1,700. $1,700? Don't worry, Pa. I got a great deal. It only ran us. And in this library were books about homosexuality being a mental illness. <laughs> and I remember going to them. Rosie Rocker in the sitcom play Helen Willis. She was 46 years old in 1975. And it was with great sadness that Rocker passed away in Los Angeles, California on December 2nd, 1995, a breast cancer. She was 66 years old. Why, Helen, what are you doing here? Well, I thought about it and I decided to come down and apologize to George. Here, Tom. But, um, he didn't like those little suits I used to put him in when we lived in New York. Mm -hmm. Those little, um, you know, camel hair polo sh uh, shirt, I mean, uh... <laughs> Belinda Tolbert in a sitcom play, Jenny Willis Jefferson. In 1975, she was 26 years old and now she is 72 years old. Moved into a bigger house in a better neighborhood. Message received. Thank you, Jenny. Allowed me to do a lot of things in the community I would not have been able to do had I not been on the Jeffersons and 227. Yeah. It allowed me to get the theater across the street, which That's I no right. longer... Marla Gibbs on the sitcom where she played Florence Johnston. In 1975, she was 44 years old and now she is 91 years old. Hubie? I might be Florence. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. The Jefferson maid. Not maid, household technician. And I noticed that most of the actresses had names that balance. If you had Margaret, the last name was either a double. Paul Benedict in a sitcom play Harry Bentley. He was 37 years old in 1975, and sadly Benedict was found dead of a brain hemorrhage at his home on December 1st, 2008. He was 70 years old. Police brutality! We got it! You're off the hook. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. J, not that way. It wouldn't be honest. Well, I would say this creature was kind of red and... Uh, Scared the, scared the overalls off. Mike Evans in the sitcom play Leonel Jefferson season 1, 6, 7, 8 and 11. He was 26 years old in 1975 and it was with great sadness that Evans dies of throat cancer in his mother's home in 29 Palms, California on December 14, 2006 at the age of 57. 
Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Are you sure you're okay? Mom, I'm okay. Well, thank God, that's all that matters. I'm glad you feel that way. I just got kicked out of school. Franklin Carver in the sitcom he played Thomas Tom Willis. He was 47 years old in 1975, and it was with red sinus that Carver died at the Lillian Booth Actors Home in Englewood, New Jersey, on February 5, 2006, at the age of 77 from pneumonia. Now, 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 calm down! It's not worth breaking up over Crazy George! Oh. Hey! <laughs> Sarah Curley in the sitcom play Mother Jefferson. She was 83 years old in 1975, and it was with great sadness that Curley died at Seattle Sinai Medical Center in Los Angeles on February 28, 1978, of lung cancer, age 86. For the reason I was wrong about Fred Williams, I had to get up and tell you, you never went out with him. You hear that, George? Jay Hammer in the sitcom he played Alan Willis. In 1978, he was 34 years old and now he is 77 years old. Oh no? Okay, let's be honest. Is there anybody here who hasn't wondered just once what it would be like to be... Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next videos.